Hello, my name is Victoria Mitchell. Thank you for taking the time to learn a little bit more about the Digital Arts Academy. The Digital Arts Academy is a school within a school, which means sophomores, juniors, and seniors participate in cohorts of about 50 students at each grade level, where they get to build a little bit more of a community, focus on different types of career development, and have an enriched school experience during their time at Sequoia. Class sizes at Sequoia High School and many high schools often can be big, with an average size of up to 36 students. In the academy, students have the opportunity to have more personalized learning experience, where they get to know teachers and their fellow students better, with an average class size of 23 students per class. In addition to that type of support, we also match juniors with a mentor on one-to-one, -one. so there is one mentor that helps guide students creating their path and assessing what they choose to do next after their time at Sequoia. The Digital Arts Academy also includes a close-knit team of teachers that know each other well and get to know their students well. Students have the opportunity to get to know their teachers better because of the smaller class size, additional activities and support that teachers provide, and the opportunity sometimes for teachers to loop with students teaching them more than um, once over their time at the three years in the academy. The Digital Arts Academy also means access to technology, and so that can be from everything to having a laptop to take home to work on your studies in different types of subjects, to having industry standard and fun gear to use in the classroom. That can be extra types of tools and um, equipment for science classes. It can be drawing tablets, digital cameras, and even drones to use for filming in the elective courses. In the academy, there are specific classes that students take at each level. There are normally three or four classes um, each year where students will take those classes as part of the academy and the rest of their schedule like PE, art, um, and electives, and foreign language, and math will be outside of the academy. Sophomores will have science, English, history, and the elective multimedia. Juniors will have science, English, U.S. history, and multimedia, and then seniors will have English, government and economics, and then digital filmmaking. The sophomore year elective multimedia creates a foundation for graphic design. We use different software applications, including Photoshop, Illustrator, and InDesign, so that students can create their own projects for different types of communication objectives. Um, they get to take their own pictures, they get to make things that we print out and they can take home with them. And this is also a course that fulfills the fine arts requirement for graduation, for um, the UC um, A through G requirements. And also it is dual aligned with Foothill Community College as an intro graphic design course. So students for free earn college credit at the same time. Junior year, students in the elective in the academy will take multimedia too. Building on the foundation created last year, students will take an intermediate pass through different types of graphic creation, and then they'll start to incorporate other types of interactive media, incorporating um, some animation and some other types of interactivity through intro programming with Scratch, um, and then some other types of content around audio um, editing as well. This course additionally is dual enrolled with intermediate graphic design at Foothill Community College. Senior year students will take a course called Digital Filmmaking, where there is a capstone on the graphics that have been created so far, again, using Photoshop, Illustrator, and InDesign, but students also will learn how to do some video production and digital filmmaking. Um, these classes all are aligned with Foothill Community College, and they culminate with a three-course graphic design certificate including many, many projects where students get to communicate clearly, effectively using industry standard tools and basically have a lot of fun. Um, junior year, students are part of a mentorship program where they are paired individually with an industry mentor that is a good match for each student. Um, there are guided activities built into the elective course that include career research, um, exposure to a broad range of careers through the career share, um, a personal inventory where students learn more about their strengths and areas of growth that they're interested in pursuing, resume writing, mock interviews, and future planning and goal setting. 
We also like to provide a lot of exposure for our students in terms of job shadow events where we um, where we visit different types of companies, as you can see listed on the screen, and they learn about, students learn about the types of roles that they can have in these local successful businesses. So the uh, Digital Arts Academy is a place for a community of young professionals where students can take themselves seriously and they can meet the high expectations that they set for themselves and with support the teachers create for them. But it's also a community just to feel like you have a place to belong and have fun during your time at Sequoia High School. That can also involve community events, barbecues, um, and other types of community building trips. The process to get into the Digital Arts Academy occurs during the freshman year. Normally at the start of second semester, students are given the opportunity through their English classes to learn a little bit more about what the, what the different um, academy programs are at Sequoia where they will fill out an application and go through an interview process. Each year we put together a cohort of about 50 students um, and it's something that there is also information provided throughout the year about how to pursue joining the Digital Arts Academy. Most students start at the beginning of their sophomore year and stay in the program for three years. Thank you very much for your interest in the Digital Arts Academy. If you have any questions about any of the things that you've seen here or other questions about how the Academy works, please feel free to reach out to me. Again, my name is Victoria Mitchell. My email address is on the screen. It's vmitchell at seq.org. Thank you so much for your time.